Alrighty. Burning box four? No. Hold on. Burning box five. Yeah, it's box five. Shh. Burning shadows box five. I got this. Sorry guys, it's very late in the day. I'm tired, but I want to open some packs. Maybe the secret rare Charizard's in here. Who knows? This might be the box. If not, I don't. I hope it's not a bad box. I'm. I'm tired of opening bad boxes. Ugh. Are you gonna be hard to open packs? Yes, they are. All right. At least I know how to open them faster. At least. Right, let's see what we've got here. Oh. Uh, uh, no. Hey, Brooks. Brook-ish? Brooks-ish? God, these names are so hard to say. Code. And as a friendly rem reminder, please keep one code per view per. So everybody has a good chance of getting a online code. If you guys get something good, let me know in the comments. If you guys bother. Oh, oh, hey! Word of War GX code. Okay, let's put everything away first. Got too excited. Go here. Very nice. Nice and shiny. So texture too. I love foil Pokemon cards. They're so fantastic. Here. Is that? Oh, sorry. Go there. but at least we are kind of off to a good start yeah and here yep. oh look a backwards pack what a surprise dust school toxic croak and a dust noir shiny too it's a foil Nice. Put that up here for you guys to see. Yeah? Are you guys able to see it? No. Let me focus it real quick for you guys. There it is. Kinda. Oh, let's continue. I'll focus as we go. Uh, finish the left stack here. So, we are still needing to finish three more Ultra Prism Trainer Boxes, Elite Trainer Boxes. And the last box was pretty bad, oh, there's something there, and a Ho-O-G-X, already got too many of you. You're cool looking, but I just need one of you, sorry. I'm still debating if I want to complete this collection or not if I do decide it's gonna make Brandon mad and probably going to leave another dislike on the video it might be him secretly I don't know probably hopefully maybe yeah oh toxic croak Oregon, Charmander, Pansar, Pikachu, Ratatat, and a Malamar. A squid. A deliciously looking squid. Yeah. 
Are there any other sets that anybody would like us to see open besides more Ultra Prism ones? Because, I don't know, there's a couple more that we can do. We can do Ancient Origins, we can do Shining Legends. I mean, if you guys would like me to do a specific set, let me know in the comments. And I'll see what I can do if I can still get that set. Preferably a good set, of course. Um, I'm pretty sure Crimson Invasion wasn't really a good set. But, I don't know, just let me know what you guys think. Tangular. And a Tangler. Again, back to back of the evolved form. So, so far we've gotten only a Ho GX and a Guardivar GX. Not bad, but still would like to see. Oh, oh, there's. Ah, Dark Ride GX. Yay. Got tons of you too. Put that there. This here. Cool. Let me turn up the brightness on this light real quick so it's easier to see on the left side oh I forgot to get Pikachu to bust it but here just bless the right side I keep forgetting forgive me Pikachu I, I have not been a very good worshiper these past few videos forgive me. Oh. okay okay I skipped everything already Anything? No. Okay. Slow King and a Lugower. Ooh. These aren't this Lucario. Okay. G. Charizard. Where are you? You gotta be in there somewhere. Cast, Dew Potter, and a Lycan Rock. No. Citra, Rodom, no thank you. So Masters 25, 25th anniversary of Magic the Gathering set is coming out pretty soon. Brandon's pretty excited about that. He'll probably be doing most of the commentary on that set because he's the magic dude. I'm just the collector dude person. We're just doing Pokemon for fun. Uh, I mean, it's pretty fun opening these packs, seeing some old original. Hey, Fuyo Guzma. Nice. Or inverse hollow Guzma. Gonna keep you down here. Go there. And we just enjoy opening packs and seeing what kind of cool pulls that we can get. We don't really have time to do any, well I don't have time to do any competitive uh, playing in the TCG. Online, yes, but I can always get online codes. Not through these boxes, of course, but through other sources. Legally. But I'm still just now recently getting back into that, so I don't really know the whole meta. I know Guardivore uh, is meta right now. But I, in, in terms of like the whole deck building and MG to Pokemon ratio, I'm not that familiar with right now. So forgive me for not being so knowledgeable. I really just like opening packs and seeing what I can pull. Hey, another Guzma, I'll keep you there. 
Nice. Inverse Hollow Guzma and a regular Guzma so far, just from the left side. Not a bad way. Not no, not a bad box so far. And what, three DXs so far? Yeah. Two Tur Tornator. And a butterfree! So cute. That episode in the Kanto series. And the Pokemon anime still makes me cry to this day on the Butterfree episode where Ash lets Butterfree go. It's so sad. Anybody watching have a favorite Pokemon episode or ending or has an ending that made them cry? There's always the classic uh, Pokemon, the movie where Ash dies and gets brought back to life from the tears of Pokemon. That makes everybody cry. Made me tear up, made me cry when I was a kid. I don't know. Let's see. Do -do. Charmeleon. Man, oh, come on. Charmeleon, you're supposed to have your bigger evolved form, secret rare form behind you. You didn't. Bummer. Oh, well. Okay, that was the left stack. Now, since Pikachu has blessed the right stack, maybe there's going to be some better results. Who knows? That was a pretty good left stack, though. Two Guzmas and three GXs. Maybe our luck might get better. Who knows? Ha! Hey! Tapu Fini GX. Not the GX card I want. But still always go with the pull one. <sighs> okay, this policy. But still, this box is much better than the last box that I pulled. Or the second box of Burning Shadows. Better box in the, than the Ultra Prism box I just pulled. That ab had absolutely nothing in there. Hey, another Guzma. Nice! This one feels heavy. It might might actually be something different, guys. Who knows? Let's see. Let's see. Lady La, Cutie Fly, Horsey, Venipede, Sneasel, Electric, and a Polysan. No. I don't know why it felt so heavy. It was full of crap. That's what it was. Yeah, if anybody's looking forward to the Masters 25 set, we have about, uh, let's see, four, uh, at least six to eight boxes, I believe, if, if I remember right, because I got four for myself. Brandon's opening one on the channel. He's got a couple other friends doing it. But yeah, if you're interested in Magic the Gathering, that's going to be a very exciting set for you guys to watch, so keep an eye out on those videos. <laughs> yeah, Mudstale. Nothing yet. Lady Ma and another Tangra. Oh joy. I still need to finish the Ultra Prism or the Ultra Sun and Moon series. Oh, oh, shiny card. It is a Galasopod GX. No. No Charizard, man. Brandon must have been lucky to pull that one regular GX Charizard card at the first box that we did. 
that he did on accident. But yeah, I still need to finish the Ultra Sun and Moon video game on the D Nintendo 3DS. Just haven't gotten around to it. Adulting takes up so much time. Uh, but hey, I mean, technically I could be doing this, could could be playing those games now instead of opening these packs. But here I am opening packs for you, for you, for you guys and myself. Ugh. Vile Bloom. Cool Vile Bloom. Nice. Sun Rock. Code. Let's see how many stacks we got. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nice. We got plenty of stacks to go on. Plenty more to go. Let's just speed it up. Electro Buzz. And Electrify. Nice. Not really. Just just come out already, Charizard. Just show your face. Please. And door for gun and that. Ralts. Hey. And a arachnid. No. Thank you. So fuck please. Whatever your name is. See you back there. I think that's gonna do it though for our rare pulls. Who knows? <coughs> One more. Edible squid. Thank you. <coughs> Stuffle. You are the first evolved form of beware. If I remember correctly, you're the pink panda. Shenotic. See Jero all the fat. Yeah, oh, let's make sure that focus. Shh. Pad phone. Come on, come on, come on. Luna Stone and a Porygon Z. That's really shiny in the back. So quiet here without Brandon opening packs. It's depressing. Do a inverse hollow a Cirola? A Cirola? Whatever. Slow king. Hey, another Guzma! At least we're pulling good Guzma. Good uh young commons. Last two packs. I'm gonna start from the very bottom this time. See what we get? Oh, oh, there's a shiny. What is it? What is it? Oh, yeah. A Necrozma GX. I don't, I don't even know if we put that one or not yet. But hey, that's a beauty. At the very, it, that, that was the very last pack on the right side, too. For any of you st statistic people with booster boxing, I'm trying to see you guys can map out. Anything from this set? Maybe, maybe not. I don't know. Ultra Prism was pretty consistent with the rate pulls that we pull from every box, but eh, I don't know. We don't know much about the Burning Shadows one yet. Nah. Oh well. And there's the last code. Alrighty. It's a recap of, uh, god, box 5, right? Box 5 of Burning Shadows? Yeah, it has to be. Alrighty, Necrozma GX. I think this is a full art. It has to be, I think. It's pretty shiny. Pretty cool looking, too. I got goosebumps there. Any gall... Gulls... Gullies, uh, pod? God. I suck at saying these names. GX card. There, Goosebumps. Tapu Fini, yay. 
another Guzma, an inverse hollow Guzma, Dark Ride GX, a Hello GX, and a I think that's full art. It has to be, yeah. Full art Cordovere GX. So shiny and pretty. Please be female. It's always weird if I think you're a male. Alrighty, thank you for watching this video. If you like the video, like it. Dislike it, dislike it. Please leave a comment. Tell me why you disliked it or liked it. And don't forget to subscribe. Thank you very much.